What is going on guys? Pro Player Apathy back in the building with another video. Today is going to be in the Mind of Apathy episode featuring 100 Thieves. We played them in a match the other night and you know it wasn't broadcasted, it wasn't streamed because it was the off stream match. So I got a really, really intense, really crazy CTF for you guys today. Uh, obviously we're on their host, hence the three bars and they're, they have two, four bars. So it's going to be a really good gameplay here. I'm going to try to teach you guys as much as I can. I don't think I've done this uh, map or game mode yet for CTF. So, this should be kind of new to you. So, off the break, I OE. Now, OEing is the best play to do here. If you don't see anyone here, because usually you meet up with someone breaks or back alley. If you don't see anyone, you OE right away. OE is the best play. Because look, watch. My teammates get two kills. I heard someone slide on their flag. So, I'm like, huh, where is this guy? Where is this guy? Hey, there you are, Nelson. Kill Nelson, pull out the flag. Uh, my teammates get two down. All I have to do here is run the flag, and all my teammates have to do is watch the mid cut and the tenth cut, which is the OE. So they get the tin cut, they get the, they got the mid cut. You saw they killed two people, and now boom, that's the cap. We get a cap within the first minute. You know, we're feeling good. I spot one guy at the end of the trade. Uh, I don't know, I believe he was weak, so I'm like, alright, I'm just gonna challenge him. Get the get the up uh, get the get the advantage over him. I get one. We get three down off the break. Nelson's last kid alive. I spawn him front. He gets taken out. And right here, I said, you know what? I'm just gonna stay in their base because we can go even for another relay. So all I gotta do is get some kills. I get one. Unfortunately, I get taken out right here. But guys, on this side, on both sides, the main thing you want to control is trains. Just like uh, just like an uplink, pretty much trains is the the most important spot. So right here, I spawn out. The best thing to do is two things. You can either rotate back around or OE. Right here, I'm taking a shortcut. It's not the worst place, worst play because there, there were no one in, there was no one in our base. So I can low key take the shortcut, so I do. But Nelson pulls out the flag. I'm trying to chase him. Want to make sure I guarantee his kill. Just boosting around trying to find him. I get the kill, and now we're still up 2-0. Now right here, rotate back trains again. For the most part, you always want to continue playing trains. You always want to have at least two people trains because trains is the most important part. So I get a kill. I notice we're, we're only two alive. It's a 2v2. So I decided to back up a little bit, play my life a little bit more. But I guess Johnny either hurt. They called me out or he saw me. So he just prepared me. Got a pretty easy kill on me. Now we have two trains right now. And I think off spawn, I might OE here. No, I decided to take shortcut. So... I was able to take this shortcut again because there was one in our grandma's and there was two in their base, I believe. So I'm low-key allowed to do this because I know there's no way I'm going to get shot in the back. But I think it goes down south pretty quick because I get shot in the back. He, It was terrible timing. Like, at least I got through, you know what I mean? But as you can see, there's two people middle. Uh, Slasher, Khalifa, and John all get a kill. So that's three down. And here we go again. We're gonna, They're going to push train. What, I don't like to push three trains sometimes. Like, you could do three train, but sometimes two train is enough. So, I'm like, all right, you guys can push train. I'm going to go down middle with whoever's with me, which is John. I go top barn immediately, and Remy does that to me. Remy was camping the corner, man. Camping the corner. It wasn't It wasn't a bad play, obviously, but it's just so annoying, like, having someone, like, do that to you. But it's all good. Uh, we spawn close to train, just uh, staying alive, trying to get some kills, putting some shots. I decided to challenge just like a maniac. Did not expect royalty to just jump out of challenge like that. But that is royalty. I should. I should have probably thought he was going to do that. So I, if, if I would have just pre there, I would have got easy kill. So off spawn, uh, you can see we have two alive in our base. I tell Khalifa, whoever's behind me, rotate back. I'm owing. And owing basically means overextending, you know, to your flag. And it could have paid off, but unfortunately my whole team dies. And I'm in, I'm still in a pretty good position though, because they don't, they did not expect me to OE. So I get flag out, smoke kind of like my cut. I guess I, I use kinetic immediately because I know he's gonna rush me. I had to guarantee this kill. You know, if if I use my kinetic there, if he kills me, there's a huge chance we probably would have had the flag out. So I get heat wave by Nelson. John cleans it up, gets the flag out. So right now we're in a good position again, up 2-0. Uh, they had they pulled the flag out, but I pulled it out and you know pretty much stopped their pull. I get this kill. That's too dead. Uh, Nelson was pushing down middle. Unfortunately, I just fly out and die to him. But we have three dead. Khalifa is with John right now with the flag. Slasher, I believe, gets the re because he killed the flag guy. And Nelson almost gets the re. But Khalifa cleans up the kill and, and caps it in. So we're now, right now, we're up 3-0. Slasher's running the flag. 
Unfortunately, I believe he's going to be taken out from 10. We did not expect the guy to be 10. So I'm just trying to help middle. You know, as soon as Khalifa gave it up, I tried to pick it up. But I died. And you guys can see, it's a fucking Man of War shit show. J their whole team, I think. None of them are using the AR. Look how we got spawn killed. I literally just spawned and I got killed. That that was like the the, the craziest timer when it comes to spawn killing. Like he must have, like as soon as he got around the corner, I spawned it and it was, he killed me. But everyone's using the Man of War. I, I believe Khalifa, John are using the Man of War. I think Slash is using the Man of War. Everyone's using the Man of War. So right here, they get a last second cap. I'm like, alright, there's nothing I can do. I'm just going to try to get some kills for my specialists and score streaks to build up for next round. So I'm just preaming. I get one. Unfortunately, I get taken out. But every kill counts towards your specialist. So it's always good to do that, guys. At the end of rounds, you know, you could you could just, like, play kills, play slow. It doesn't matter. So we're going to the next round up 3-1. You know, this is kind of considered the bad side. But we still have a pretty good lead. So right here, push OE right away, straight into 10. Uh, I, do, I don't do this all the time, but I do it sometimes. You know, and then this, 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 yeah. Yeah, that, that, that's what happens to me. Royalty back in their silos. Um, you know, I mean, I, I guess it's not a bad play. Again, like I said, it's not a bad play, but I just hate that people play like that. So, they, so we get taken out. Uh, it's only me and someone else alive, but we spawn on a pinch, on a flag. I don't know why these guys are freaking lightning like that but they decided to lightning so right here i'm just holding back barn going back to top barn apparently they have a cerberus now i pick up a kill i don't know when the hell they got streaks it must have been royalty maybe that's why he was camping the back of spawn but i gun remby right here to try to stay alive with the man of war uh gun nelson right here and i think we're trying to pull i get taken out johnny gets a two-piece at the end of the train. This is such a hard position to do, but Slasher wants a gunfight and gets us. So John ended up pulling out the flag, but he got Tempest. Roti gets a two pieces of Tempest. Sherby gets a kill. I turn around immediately, read the OE OE push. Easy reads, get the kill. And I'm trying to EP a Serby. I think we get it right away, dude. Sir like Serbies lately just get taken out quickly. That's why I don't like using Serby sometimes. Like I think using a Wraith better, but you hear that shit? Out of nowhere, they have a fucking Wraith 2. So, at this time, it's bad. They have a sort of spawn trap. They have a Wraith. I'm like, all right, I'm going right away. You know, I think I could get through. I get through. Almost gun royalty, but, yeah, it's not going to work out. I believe at this point, Slasher, John's shooting the, the, he was shooting the Wraith. Slasher pulled out the Black Cell, trying to blow it up. Off spawn, I'm trying to shoot out. You guys can see it, but I'm pretty sure it's camo mode right there. That's why I was like looking around. Don't think I'm a dumbass. And then I think a slasher died. And they get another flag. They cap the flag and they pull out another flag. And we're at this point, we're like, shit, we need to fucking take out the Wraith. This is like, what the fuck? Now they're up 3 3. They pull the flag out again. The Wraith is still up. I'm just playing the read, dude. I have to clutch up here. This is such a big clutch up. I kill Scythe with flag. Get the re. Nelson, he waves me. It's all good. I saw my kinetic. I decided not to use it right there because that would have been very dumb of me. And they're still trying to take out the Wraith. They're still trying to shoot out the Wraith. I believe it finally went away. But they got two flags because of the Wraith and getting sent to spawn trap. So now it's 3-3, right? You're like, holy shit. This is... Yo, Envy was just up. 3-1. Like, this is crazy. And they pull the flag out again. Johnny takes out one. I'm just trying to stay alive. I try to kill Johnny. I get the re again. This is my second time getting the re within the first 30 seconds. Or the first, uh, the last like, 30 seconds. Oh, uh, we get two down again. So I rotate back to flag. He pulls it out. I started chase in, trying to, trying to cut him off, but I have no idea where the fuck he went. Apparently he went to the back. I get one. He went back into our barn, or like back barn, staying alive. I get the re a third time. At this point, you're like, okay, Apathy, good fucking shit. You keep getting the re. You're making some plays. Oh, they pull the flag again. And he wasn't weak. If he was weak, that melee would have worked. But unfortunately, he wasn't. I, I was trying to do sh uh, the shoot melee. It's like an instant kill type of thing. But he just he just came to my face too fast. I forgot to like shoot really quick. I couldn't react fast enough. So now. After Apathy clutches up like three times to get the Ray, they were down a flag because they got the Ray. So I'm like, here, my whole team dies. I'm like, fuck me. I got to go big. So I get one. My teammate spawns decently close. I'm like, all right, rotate, rotate back, rotate back. There's a minute left. 
I get gunned by Remy with his Man of War on host. Kind of rough, but it's all good. He picks up the two P's. It's looking slow. They're all in their base. We have 50 seconds left. At this point, you know, it's hard. But I get a kill. Uh, Khalifa gets the guy trying to pull our flag. I just decide to run straight down the middle. There's no one even watching down the middle. So I'm like, alright. Alright, guys. I'm like, alright, guys. I can get into grandmas. I can get into grandmas and pull. This is exactly what I said. So I pre aim here in case someone runs up to me like that. Melee him. Smoke flag. Guy back got spot of Tempest. Pre fire in. I decide to pull out now. I go out. Sasha gets one. Apathy spots Woodwall. Apathy helps out with Woodwall. Three dead. Let's get Johnny. I, I killed Johnny earlier. Everyone's rotating back. 20 seconds left. No way they do. He's trying to keep the flag as much to the right in case he flies up to us. You know, um, uh, Sasha can kill him before he gets to re. 30 seconds left. He pulls the flag out. I sit in the corner and wait for him. We cap. With eight seconds left, we cap. Now, this is the fucking stupidest shit you're going to ever see me do in my entire life. Please, next time, roast me, team. Six seconds left. I'm one kill off a of lightning and one kill off a of hellstorm. We're going to overtime. In my mind, I guess I thought, like, it's over. Like, I was just so happy we capped, I guess, and so hyped that I do this. If I would have just stayed there pre-aimed and got the kill, I have a guaranteed lightning. And maybe even a hellstorm. But it's all good. It's all good. Now it's overtime. All right, so with, with like, 40 seconds remaining, we pull a crazy cap out. You know, it was intense. Now we're in overtime. So we went somehow up 3-1. Down 4-3. And we just tie it up. So, it's crazy CTF so far. Um, That fucking Wraith helped them so much get these flags. I get Heat Wave off spawn. I'm like, fuck, rotate back. He's weak. Thankfully, someone plays Wood Wall, dude. Who was that? Oh, Slasher, dude. I gotta tell my teammates to do that more in CTF. Because sometimes, I don't know if it's 8s, but my teammates always get taken out. So, Slasher's last one in the base. I'm rotating back. I gun uh Johnny. He was a little bit weak, I believe. So, that helped me. Like I said, rotating back to trains, very essential, very important. They start using smokes. Here comes Nelson with a smoke, so I pre-aim right here. Gonna try and catch him running to past me. I got him weak, so I decided to challenge him, pick up an easy kill. Uh, maybe a guy small room, so I decided to push out. And guess what? Remy in the corner with, yeah, this, this is Remy for you. That, that sneaky, very aggressive, but like corner camping player. So Remy popped this kinetic, gets the three-piece. I'm like, it's all good. I spawn our base, and then he's... I'm like trying my best to stay alive. I'm like, he's on me, he's on me. He picks up one. This is a good play by me, just staying alive, uh, being safe. I pop my kinetic, uh, you know, make sure I get the kills in their base. At this time, we have four dead. Austin pulled the flag. So that kinetic play was so good because it pretty much just guaranteed us a cap. So we get a cap within the first minute, like, what, 30, minute 23. And they were so close. To, to fucking pulling our flag out but you know i think khalifa got one or, or slasher got one and i got two piece with my kinetic as you guys can see i'm 26 to 22 with two caps and five returns <sighs> five returns so now in overtime jesus you can see i don't really get a kill for almost the whole side until like towards the end um right here i side i don't know if i push OE or i watch it i guess the smart play would be to just push it or, yeah, okay, I play slow. Yeah, that's a, that's a better play by me. And just rotate back if I don't see anything. So, the last two are, are barn side. They got two dead. They decided to do four train. We're looking for Johnny and Remy right now. I spawn uh, Remy. I call him one shot up top. I'm like, challenge is one shot. I decide to help Khalifa up top. I hear a scythe, which is probably Johnny. Just scything somewhere in front of our base. There he goes. Uh, Khalifa gets one. I decide to hit the back. And out of nowhere, they fucking pour a flag. So this is a tough one again. It's a 2v2. But uh, thankfully, John kills the flag guy trying to challenge him. I get taken out from middle. But last guy's middle. Uh, Sasha pulls outside. Johnny Nelson were the last ones up again. 30 seconds remaining. They have to stop this pool right here. If we can stop this pool, it's game. Sasha gets the kill. It's pretty much guaranteed at this point. This guy's heat wave. That's how to fly out like a fucking monkey and challenge. Get the kill. There's no way they can really win at this point. You know, we have two people on our flag. It's practically impossible with the scythe. So, right here, we win some good games. This was a crazy, crazy CTF. Um, you know, just, it, it, like, CTF is a lot about waiting for each other and pushing together, you know? Like, you got to make sure you wait for each other. And sometimes, I mean, sometimes you can just OE and do plays like that. But it, a lot of times, just pushing the right way and playing as a team, examples, 
waiting for each other, communicating, you know, small talking, you know, it's stuff like that. That's how you're really going to be successful in CTF. But we managed to pull the W out of our ass. I hope you enjoyed today's video. You know, not even just in the mind of apathy, but the gameplay itself. It was really fun. It was a crazy intense CTF. I wish I had recorded, but, you know, I stopped recording league matches because I feel like I'm just really focused on practicing right now and getting better as a team and individually. And I don't want to have to worry about, you know, recording and then posting gameplay. Like, I just, all I want to worry about and care about is the game itself and what I'm playing. But either way, guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. This has been your boy, Apathy. Leave a like for the 6 ETF, and I'm out. Peace.